It's officially crunch time in Arkansas. Six months from today is the deadline to get your real ID. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us for Fox 16 News. I'm Kevin Kelly. I'm Donna Terrell. October 1st. Anyone who boards a domestic flight or enters a federal building will certainly need to show one. Our Hunter Hoagland joining us live from the DMV. Hunter, still a lot of Arkansans, they still have to get theirs. Yeah, Donna, a lot is right. 1.8 million Arkansans have yet to get their real IDs, which has become a real concern for some. The countdown is on. We are officially six months from this October 1st, 2021 date. Six months until the deadline to get your real ID. <laughs> Meaning if you're wanting to do this, you're going to need this. If you go to board a flight, you are going to need the real ID. Scott Harden with the Department of Finance says their biggest concern is that folks will show up to the airport in October without a real ID and be turned away. If you're gonna fly from here to Dallas, here to Los Angeles, here to Vegas, whatever the case may be, you're going to need that real ID. States have had since 2005 to implement the real ID and with the final stretch underway, Still, nearly 2 million Arkansans have yet to get theirs. It is kind of a pain. You've got to bring all sorts of documentation, and just when you think you have it all, it turns out you didn't have the right ID. You need five different forms of ID before you go. One, proving legal presence. Another, proving your identity. Something, showing your social security number. And two, proving you're a resident of Arkansas, like a utility bill or bank statement. It's going to be another trip. You know, we thought we had everything. We were scrambling to get here, a long line, and then all of a sudden it turns out we got to go back home and get some more. We have a, a very full understanding that Arkansans don't want to be spending more time in a revenue office than is required. Which is why Hardin says don't wait until the final minute to get yours. Get it done now and save time later. Don't want you waiting in line. If you get in and out now, you can probably save yourself some, some serious time. And there is a short quiz online walking you through everything you need before coming to the DMV. I've posted that on our website, fox16.com. For now, we're live in Little Rock. I'm Hunter Hoagland. Back to you. All right, Hunter, thank you very much. Keep in mind, you can get your real ID at all 134 revenue offices throughout the state. There's no difference in price for a real ID or a regular license. If you're getting it for the first time, it will cost you $40 to upgrade. It will cost $10 for a duplicate and $5 for a state ID.